So the Iowa DOT is gonna reconstruct the Hickman interchange. They're gonna change it from a standard diamond to a divergent diamond. Um, the biggest difference with that is how you make your movements at the intersections. A divergent diamond is much safer. You do not have to cross the opposing traffic to make your movements on or off of the interstate. Following the city's complete streets policy, uh, we recently completed a project on the north side of Hickman Road where we built a 10-foot trail from Walnut Creek east over to the signalized entrance into the Lifetime Fitness area. So with this project, we'll continue that trail. We'll have two pedestrian overpasses that'll go over the interstate ramps and then a culvert that'll go under the interstate, which will allow you to go through the interchange and continue east over to the signalized intersection of 111th Street or the entrance into Living History Farms. Um, in addition to that, the city will be constructing a trail from 111th Street East over to 100th Street. For the traveling public that are going, say, west on Hickman Road, as you're coming up to the intersection today, you would just continue west on a straight line. In the future, you'll actually move to the other side of the road through a signalized intersection. That's where the safety benefits come into play. Basically, again, you get to go left onto the interstate or off the interstate without having to actually cross that opposing traffic. So it eliminates the potential for those left turning crashes. There'll be enhanced landscaping throughout the entire Hickman corridor and there'll also be monument signs added in the medians to kind of help beautify one of our key entrance features into the city of Urbandale. So the stormwater management portion of the project is critical for the city of Urbandale. Um, part of the project will be installing bioswales using soil quality restoration and installing bioretention areas. All of this will help protect the water quality in the area. Urbandale is looking forward to the completion of this project as it will make an intersection with the Metro much safer than it is today.